What's up guys, Darkish Raider. This is my first video using the camera on the PlayStation Vita, which I believe has better quality than the camera, the webcam on my laptop. I don't know, you guys tell me what you think. But this is Gameology for Starhawk, which is set to come out tomorrow. And this is like the first game I'm gonna get without looking at the review on IGN, cause I'm pretty confident even if IGN gives this game a 0 out of 10, I'm really confident it's not going to stop me from going out and buying it tomorrow. But here are my thoughts on the game overall. Starhawk is a sequel to 2007 hit Warhawk, which is an all multiplayer game. Free demo on PSN if you guys want to check it out. But the improvements, the innovation Starhawk brings just it's really designed to keep you playing for a long time. I mean, the gameplay never stays the same with its build and battle system. Like, and it has an ever-changing landscape of a battlefield. Just dropping buildings out the sky with a freaking weapons and warhawks that transform into mechs. Giant, giant vehicles. I notice the vehicles are a lot larger than they are in Warhawk. Uh, hopefully, I hope they have all the weapons that are on Warhawk, especially the binoculars. On the beta, I didn't see the binoculars. And I was real bummed out. Hopefully, I know Warhawk did have some patches that you download that installed the the wrench, which the wrench, you can use it as a knife, but it also repairs and damages. Repairs your own team's vehicles and damages the other team's vehicles. Also, the biofield, which heals your teammates and it hurts the other team. But just implementing all the weapons Warhawk had, and if not, I just want I just want this game to be as strategic as possible. Because from everyone else's opinion that I've heard, this game is really strategic, just like Warhawk. Uh, I know me being a real Warhawk fanboy. I'm gonna get this game regardless of what IGN has to say. You guys know, gonna give you guys a review on it, give you guys some gameplay. Video game industry is really starting to get the big picture. You know, games that star black people are destined to be hits. Prototype 2, Radical realized it. Starhawk's doing it. Assassin's Creed's doing it. I mean, yeah, I know he's really Native American only half but it's probably as close as as close as a black assassin as we're gonna get the single player campaign on Starhawk Warhawk was an online only game now they're giving Starhawk a single player campaign which I think is a it's not a bad idea it doesn't hurt but I already know a lot of people especially the Warhawk fans are just gonna play this game for it's multiplayer. I saw a lot of gameplay footage of a, a laser beam freaking taking out Starhawks and all that. And I was like, wow, this game just... The destruction level on this game just might match Warhawks, if not exceed. So, I'm pretty sure this game is going to do good. Those are my uh, thoughts on Starhawk. Raider out.